Hello, dear friends. It will have to be seen to be believed, but they feel searing in a strange silence. Opinion piece. Solo flash. Photon surge. NASA has denied it. A scientist predicted it now. Are we at a critical moment? No cause for concern. Now is a rest period. Esoteric and scientific interpretation. Let's start. It seems that the countdown clock in the round letter was not completely wrong. The Arlequin has said that the solo flash has already begun on the Sil Romero and Pato Brusa channel. It would no longer be in April as he said before. In his opinion, it began yesterday, Friday morning and will last three days, but his influence would be 11 days. It is being much more subtle than expected, and this subtly would correspond to very high frequencies that you cannot feel if you do not have them. In his opinion, we are in a quantum leap that we were waiting for and that humankind has not experienced for 26,000 years. Stay relaxed by watching movies and listening to calm music, etc. Excuse me. The sun's activity has increased in recent months, and the peak of its life cycle, expected in mid-2025, appears to be ahead of this year. However, the Space Weather page says that the solar storm will not hit Earth, but I doubt this claim. A plasma tornado in the Sun's northern hemisphere broke up on December 28th and spewed a rotating cloud of hot gas into the sky. Space NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory recorded its leak. At first glance, this small cloud may seem inconsequential. However, upon existing the Sun's atmosphere, it triggered magnetic instability that developed into a surprisingly large coronal mass ejection. Solar prominences are large plasma structures that extend from the Sun's surface into its outer atmosphere called the corona. They can last for days or months, and scientists are not sure how and why they form. Charged particles ejected during the solar flare can interact with Earth's magnetosphere and cause auroras in polar regions, although this would have no direct impact on human health. Auroras can be spectacular and are observed as natural phenomena. Esoteric Interpretation A solar flash is a wave of photons. It is photonic light. In stellar language, the solar flash is called the solar pattern or solar magnitude. It occurs every time a planet jumps to an octave of frequency. That is, every time it changes dimension because the planet is placed under a main sun greater than that of its system, which may be the sun of Alcyon in the Pleiades or the suns of Orion or that of Sirius. We, being solar beings by design, when the plasma of these flashes or storms impacts the physical body, what they do is accelerate the spin of the electron in our molecular structure, causing the dense energy of baryons to become tachyonic energy and dematerialize the dense 3D matter. That is why our ascension will be done without dying, because the solar flashes will disintegrate everything that vibrates slow and will lead us to the subtly of the fifth dimension. Another purpose of solar lighting is to transport light codes and install new codes in the body. Prediction Physicist Scott McIntosh, director of the U.S. National Center for Atmospheric Research, said in June 2023 that everything indicates that the peak intensity would arrive at the end of 2023 
or beginning of 2024, which would mean a terminator event. Macintosh relies on information collected by his team over 20 years of collating solar intensity data since 1750. This phenomenon called terminator occurs when the usual solar cycle that lasts 11 years abruptly ends, changing the polarity of the star, and the new cycle begins with more intensity. When one solar cycle ends and the next begins, the sun can experience enormous magnetic field shocks, resulting in gigantic tsunamis of plasma that can remain on the surface of the sun for weeks. The citizen does not have the, to worry about the critical vulnerabilities of large infrastructures, but the problem would be if the electrical grid were damaged by a solar event and the water could not be purified. The leap from 200 years ago to contemporary techno-scientific society causes new dangers due to the system overload, the drop in radio emissions, GPS navigation or communication satellites. There is no need to dramatize, to dramatize nor do we have to become paranoid, but it is advisable to analyze to what extent we are vulnerable. The ad is completely subjective subjected to the activity of the sun, and when it reaches violent levels in the form of eruptions of solar flare, increases in radiation and emission of very energetic particles are generated that directly affect our planet. When a large mass of plasma from the sun hits the earth, the solar wind causes geomagnetic storms in the upper layers of the atmosphere. Definition. In astronomy, a solar flash refers to a phenomenon in which a flash or explosion occurs on the surface of the sun, such as a solar flare. This event can release large amounts of energy in the form of light, radiation, and charged particles. A solar flare is a sudden brief release of energy into the sun's atmosphere, manifested by a sudden increase in brightness in a specific region of the, sun, of the sun's dick. During a solar flare, large amounts of electromagnetic radiation are emitted, including visible light as well as charged particles. These solar flares can be classified into different categories based on their power with class X flares being the strongest. These events can have an impact on communications and the electrical grid in addition to generating auroras in the polar regions. Solar observers and dedicated space instruments study solar flares to better understand solar activity and its effects on our environment. Solar storms are very energetic and occur when large-scale explosions occur on the surface of the sun that release a large amount of mass and energy into the interplanetary medium. These manifestations follow 11-year cycles and during the maximum of activity, it is possible that three or four occur in one day, while during the minimum one every four days. They, they expel an incandescent gas at a, at a speed that can exceed 2,000 kilometers per second and reach the Earth in one day. When plasma impacts our planet, natural phenomena such as the northern and southern lights occur and the north and south poles as well as phenomena that affect our technology. Diffusion or disclosure. So what should happen at this critical moment, asks Penny Moore. There are several probabilities that may occur in the future. To begin with, a great deal of disclosure will be revealed to the citizens regarding involvement with non-terrestrial and the society's kept secrets regarding its existence. This has been hidden for a long time. Revelation can be a step ahead of the entity of darkness to defeat them at their own game. Some starseeds and light bearers have been preparing for these changes for years and will help people acclimate, acclimate to their higher frequencies. The solar flare will not only increase the frequency of humankind and the earth, 
but will also herald the new earth. You all struggle to try to fit into a dysfunctional society, ruled by control and greed. That's why holy money was rewarded for so long. Now is a period of rest, so to speak, to rejuvenate and readjust in order to be prepared to help humankind. Star seeds, light bearers, and others will be needed to help and comfort people who go into shock as more things and the effects of the solar flash are revealed. People will deal with this great influx of light in different ways. Thus, the star seeds and the missionaries of light will be in charge to comfort and continue helping to heal their fellow human beings. Much love, understanding and compassion will be needed for all humanity. Universal laws and knowledge will be used to reconstruct cities on precise grid lines. All of this will be possible because of the correct knowledge that will be presented along with incredible technologies that have been hidden by governments. Everything will be recreated for the benefit of not only humanity and society, but also the earth. Everything must be in resonance and balance to help the growth and rise of everyone. Our message is one of hope and assurance that everything is moving in a higher resonance where it should be, to lay the plans as to what is to come for the unfolding of the new earth. There is no need to worry about what is coming. It is better to be excited by the expectation of higher earth imbued with love and light. Your role now is to be at peace. Keep your frequency high. Do what gives you joy. Everything is as it would be. Changes. According to Jennifer Hoffman, the year 2024 brings some monumental changes to individual and global paradigms. So prepare to intensify your intention and manifestation, especially the part that involves that you receive and how you expand your reality because you are the central beneficiary of this new paradigm. Being is your key to success, joy, peace, love, and abundance. Unstoppable trends for 2024, according to Greg Hunter. The war will continue in various places in the world, especially in the Middle East. Democrats are divided on mass illegal immigration, the economy and Israel. Revelations and electoral desperation, desperation reach a peak. Cheap tanks so bad, everyone will know. How do you change the faith dimensional being by Nikki Hamid? You have to be willing to be wrong about almost everything you thought you knew in 3D, so that everything turns at, upside down and you are okay with not knowing and open to miracles and possibilities that didn't appear as opinions in your old paradigm. To make the transition, you have to believe that even if you have no idea how something can change or manifest, it is possible, and you just have to be present. Mm. He appears exposed and vulnerable, open and in love. Everyday life if you are mystery school, and every change you make is a sacred initiation if you allow it. Your entire life is being transformed, and this requires a deep and intense trust in yourself and in the source for the complete development of the what, the how, and the when of everything that appears in your life. Short notice, short news. Sorja Fall believes that Biden falls into a Russian bear trap in the war with China. The Pentagon is trying to ensure the security of the shipping sector in the Red Sea amid ongoing Houthi attacks. The Yemeni Navy has launched another operation against the Swiss-based cargo ship MSC United 8, despite the presence of the US Navy in the Red Sea. Israel would plan to relocate 100,000 Palestinians to Egypt. X-22 report. Spain follows Germany in the new green agenda. People will realize that this does not benefit them. Canada's housing market is collapsing. People are seeing a contraction. Central banking is panicking about altcoins. Bob Kutla talks about the rising price of electricity in Germany. 
and that people are going to push back against his government's agenda in the end. The economy is collapsing and there is a graph showing where this is all going. There is a market correction coming most likely at the beginning of the year. Bitcoin and gold will rise as the Fed cut rates. Americas. Milei formally renounces Argentina's entry into the BRICS. Guyana does not plan any offensive action against Venezuela. Curious. Scientists have a conversation with a humpback whale. Some elves are shown in the forest according to Erwin Saunders. Aladdin's cave discovered on Oak Island, but not yet but not the treasure yet. And that's all for today. Thanks a lot, dear friends.